Alright, welcome back guys, my name is Nick, also on Touch Ninja, and we are once again playing some Walking Dead Episode 3, Long Road Ahead. And in the last episode, Lily Snap killed Carly, figured out that Duck was bitten. Um, pretty much a life's a living hell right now. We're about to get some ass from Carly, but the, you know, the whole bullet in the head thing kind of... Stops that, unless you're a sicko, of course. <laughs> and now we got like a train that's in front of us that we have to search. So, once we get past this black screen deal, then we'll get searching. There you go. Now we just got a loading screen to deal with. Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. On foot, maybe. Can't really afford to do that now. This seems like a safe area. All this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. And I'd like everyone out of the RV except her. I don't want folks trapped in there with her. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Clem, stay close to Kenny and Kat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, hon. Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? That would cross my mind. All right, let's get searching here. I guess I'll talk to you first. Was it you? Not this again. Was it? No! Okay then. You, uh, happy you stayed with us all this time? Yeah. Really? It's with you guys or dead. I would have died out there in the woods. Just like my classmates. You think this is better? Yeah, of course. What would you have done with Lily? I don't know. Left her? I've never seen anybody kill someone like that before. Yeah, you've seen a bunch of other stuff by now. Yeah, but not like that. There's a difference when you're a mindless zom zombie, and then there's also a difference between killing someone in absolute cold blood. Jesus. The door to the boxcar. Ah, fantastic. We got hobos. Whoa. Somebody's been living in here. Yeah, man. Shit, think they're gone? I hope so. But this looks recently used. Gross. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. Just because you're homeless doesn't mean you have to be disgusting. A clipboard. A map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Route 27, Savannah. That's where Kinney's got us headed. We got a map. Looks unopened. Water. I'll take this to Kanja for duck. I'll do it now. I'm too nice of a guy, what can I say? We found this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. These tracks lead right to Savannah. Holy hell. Can you guys see about moving that thing? We could have something here. Yeah, we're on it. Yeah, we'll get right on moving a train. 
Thanks. You worried about keeping her in there? I cracked a window. I sure as hell don't want her out here with us. Has Clementine said anything to you about Carly or Duck or anything? I'm worried about her. No. That little girl is a puzzle. Yeah, she is. Poor Carly. God, where did yesterday go? I don't know. Are you okay? I know you were fond of her. I was. This isn't any time for, you know, romance, but yeah. I was, uh, fond of her, yeah. How's that? I don't know. Tired. Which could mean a lot of things, right? Yeah. His body's probably fighting whatever's in it. Exactly. Have you heard anything out of Lillian there? Not a peep. I don't like that. She's probably in shock. She did a monstrous thing. Anyway, let me know if anything changes here. Here, found some water. Oh, thank you. Perfect. He's allergic to bees. Is that right? It's all I can keep thinking about. Like, somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Well, I don't, but you're probably right. Hey, Clem. What are you going to do with Lily? <laughs> Punish her somehow. She did a terrible thing. She killed her. Yeah, it, it's horrible. G-Boss. I'm gonna check out the other cart. Keep that gun handy. <laughs> Tools. Nice. Take them all. Oh god. I gotta need this a specific tool for something. We'll see what it is in a second. What's in here? No bueno. No bueno. Swing and a miss. Gun or glass? Ah, glass. Oh. Suppose we gotta look him over. Yeah. Thud. He's missing half his face. I don't think this guy came back. Christ. That light is blinking. Push it. Push it? Why not? Are you fucking serious? Here, look.
It's just the brakes. Okay, I'll give you that one. This fucker works? Seems like it. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. That's Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. Well, let's look around. Maybe it goes somewhere we'd like to be. Ben, if you could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Man, this could be exactly what we need. What's that? Until maps about Georgia's cities. Nothing about the train. Ah! Uh, 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 uh. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. Why would someone... Can I see the indentations from the writing? I need chalk. Hey, kid. What's up? Uh, hope it's all right I chose to keep Lily with us. Abandoning someone on the side of the road is the same as murder. Turning over a new leaf, huh? I'm just doing what I can. It's fine for now, but we have to deal with it eventually. God, we need some help getting this train going. People take notes, right, when working on stuff like this? Uh, we're smart guys, we can figure it out. You want to talk about that? I'm really sorry, Kitty. Nobody deserves this. There's nothing to talk about. You heard Cat. He could be fine. We probably shouldn't ignore it. Nobody's ignoring nothing. I'm not worried. You shouldn't be either. Like how he's so quick to bash in Larry's head, but when it comes to his kid, he's yeah, hesitating. We need some help getting this train going. People take notes, right, when working on stuff like this? Uh, we're smart guys. We can figure it out. I'll get back to it. Me too. Gotta get some chalk from Clem. I didn't see what's on the other side of the train yet, though. Yeah, Kenny's a hypocrite. Most definitely. Huh. Definitely pry this thing free if I can break it loose first. It's stuck. We need a bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free. So we need three guys to work on that. Looks like it'll get that pin out. Oh. Broken. Poor sauce. Okay. I'll work on getting the engine started. We're gonna need three guys with three different crowbars to pry her out. 